So Ryan, it's the first chance we've had to sit down and chat for a bit, a little while, and since then you've had Aura leaving out the team with COVID. I mean, it's been a been a while since, but how are you feeling now? No, no, I'm. Uh, I feel like I'm gradually building up fitness every single fixture. Um, um, like I said, it was a while out. I was out of the team. Um, obviously, I can't help getting COVID, but uh, that was the reason, or part of the reason, that I was I was out for so long. Um, but I'm just glad to be back in Bournemouth. Yeah, what was the, the worst bit about COVID for you? You were saying that, was it the breathing that was hard for you or? Just the aches and the pains. Um, <clears throat> knowing that where, where my fitness levels are at as to where they were when I had COVID, when I'd recovered from having the, having the illness, that I was just nowhere near up to where I wanted to be. Um, and that's when I had to let the gaffer know and, and furs and what have you and, and they had to deal with me and uh, accept that I want in a good way. Well, you have been back in the team since Grimsby was the first one back. But before then, it was Boxing Day, I think, last time you played 90 minutes. Um, we've seen a better side since then, more players coming in. Have you noticed a difference since coming back into the squad? Yeah, I have because Boxing Day was when we was working around a small squad. I think there was times where sometimes we'd have four or five on bench. Now you're looking at it and we've got a miles bigger squad. Um, we've, like I say, we can freshen things up if it, if it's needed. Um, we've probably seen that in the last, well, since after January, that there's been a lot of changes to the team here and there, and and I think it's it's been a benefit to all of us. And obviously, the results have come with that. I think what is it? We've won seven of our last ten, so it's it's obviously having a it's obviously playing a part. Do you enjoy the challenge of more competition? I mean, you always want to play, but you you've got you've got to relish that challenge of um, competing against other people. That's that's the nature of the job. You've got to be able to deal with that and and and, and be better and be better than the person that's. If I'm not playing, that's in front of me. Um, so so yeah. Against Colchester the other day, seven of the starting eleven back in National League North days, pretty much that team. Um, you were one of them. Yeah. How does it feel to be on that journey and be here now and how it was back then? It's weird because I was just I was talking to Lloyd about it not long ago and I said like even back then you're talking for you I was 21 year old then I feel like I feel ancient now I feel like I'm 25 now I feel like I've been here for ages. Um, but yeah, when when you do look at it like that. Um, it speaks for itself really doesn't it as uh, how far not just the seven players that are, that are still here now but everyone how far the club's come and how, how well we've done with that collective group that you've just said uh, how far we've come as well when we played Forest Green earlier in the season at our place it was a 1-0 loss but do you feel like there was much between the sides in that game? it was a tight game um, and uh, like I said previously to you <laughs> The goal did come from down my side. Um, I got to do better one v one defend one v one with it with their winger, and he, he's had the better of me and got past me, and, and, and they've scored. So, like I say, it, that was the I said, I said it the other day uh, after the game at Stevenage. It, it is fine margins, um, and them fine margins can be the difference between the two teams, whether it be one nil to us or one nil to them. And on the day when we played them last time. It, that was the fine margin mm. that the, the lads got past me and, and put it across the box and we scored. Uh, they've scored, sorry. So, like I say, it makes a difference. The side you do like to get it down and pass it around. Are you expecting this to be one of our tougher games of the season away from home? To be honest, I think uh, there's, there's no easy game in this league. I think every game is, is just as hard as the one that you've had before or the one before that. Um, there's... You look at the league and you, we play Grimsby and Barrow recently and both games are 1-0 and they are both tight games. But the pleasing thing for us is that we've been keeping the back door shut for quite a few few weeks now. Obviously, we lost to Stevenage, but I mean it, it's a positive to take when, you, when you're not conceding goals. So I'd expect it to be a tight game. I expect them, the league doesn't lie. They're, they're, I think they're third in the league, so they've obviously got some at bottom to be, to be up there. Well, best of luck for Saturday. Yeah, cheers.